Hi guys, welcome to Rufio. Joe back again. We got another deck profile from locals today. Uh, this guy knocked me out of the tournament today. I was uh, XO with my burn in the abyss for the first <laughs> time ever. I didn't lose a single game, and this guy just ruined my life. So yeah. <laughs> he gets the uh, he gets the privilege of a deck profile today. So yeah. who are you? What did you do? How did you get on? All of that malarkey. Uh, right. Uh, my name's Rob. Um, I came second. So I got to the final and then we had a battle of the bricks. And who did you lose to? Ricardo. Rick, who's with us. Italian, Italian boy over here. Yeah, that was the uh, battle of the bricks, that was. Um, yeah, I've been playing Thunder Dragon Dino since Soul Fusion came out. You took yeah. this to YCS too, right? I did indeed, and I went 5-3. Okay, that's not too bad. Not too, bad. not too bad for a local boy, right? Not too bad for a local boy, and not too bad, bear in mind, I hadn't even played the deck before the day. So let's, uh, <laughs> let's not get too far into this. Let's have a look, at the, like, let's have a look at the spice. Alrighty. So for the dino part, we've got three over Raptor. Mm -hmm. Have like to. That, yeah. If that needs explaining, then I'm sorry. I'm not <laughs> it doesn't it. need explaining. <laughs> um, two Quatless and two UCT. Do you think two Quatless and two Ultimate Conductor is correct? Yeah, I'd even potentially consider bumping this to three. Really? Because you need at least two of them for the combo, because you want to go first with this deck. Okay. Um, using the over Raptor or Armageddon Knight to send this to the grave mm -hmm. and get your pill. Um, and also it's a dark for alert, so it's actually quite good to like So it. you can always get rid of it, I suppose. Yeah, and the UCT, yeah, that's only there for later on in the game. It's too, that card's nuts anyway. That card's ridiculous. Such an yeah. enabler. Like, you sometimes summon it going first if you know what you're playing against. Yeah, like, but, like you yeah. did to me. Yeah, like I did to you, <laughs> yeah. Um, then 3-1 of dinos, We've got Miscellaneousaurus. Broken. Bring my brother back. He's so good. It's not happening. Giant Rex, because Lagia and Dolka are good cards. I've seen a few people running out of two. How do you feel about that? Yeah, like you don't want to get locked out of it if you have to banish it twice in a turn. Yeah. But that's never came up for me yet. So, so one, one's fine. Yeah, one's been good to me. Cool. Uh, then one Pancratops, yep. because this card is ridiculous. The boy. Best card in Soul Fusion, and it's common. Best card at Sneak Peek. It's so good. Um, I'm not even running Dogron, or even in the side. Okay. Space. This card's just better. I suppose you got other you got other options with everything else that you're running. Yeah, but yeah sufficiently cover options. that anyway. Um, the other normal summon because you need more copies of Overactor. Cards going to one. Yeah, this card rest in peace. Um, <laughs> this is really good as well because it means if you open a bunch of dinos and you're missing the Thunder Dragon cards, you can then use this to dump the Thunder Dragons as well. Yep. So yeah, adds some utility to the deck. Then we've got three Dark, three Raw, and two Hawk. This guy is very, very bad to open, so you just want to search him. But you do need two, because I was running just one yep. when I was playtesting hands before the YCS. And then I realised it's fine, because you're not going to open it, but people don't always scoop when you have a Colossus. Yep. You need the second one for doing plays in the next turn. Is that only the Thunder Dragon stuff you're running? That's There's a fusion as well. But how, how do you feel about those like, like ratios and numbers? Um, I wouldn't want to run like the OG Thunder Dragon because that is just dead in this. Mm -hmm. Matrix, eh, I've thought about it, but these are all dark and it works with Allure. No, okay, yeah, and it's just true. trying to make Allure as consistent as possible because mm -hmm. this plus Allure is pot grade. It's amazing. Um, who needs Engage when you've got a two card combo that does That's the right. same thing? Engage is going too, <laughs> thank God. <laughs> Um, then the last monsters is three ash. It's three MVP. ash. And again, I've I've asked this already someone else today, but uh, three ash. Do you think that's correct? Yes, ash is correct. Ghost bell. If I had them, I would probably be paying playing like two ash, two bell, and I'd yep. take something else out. Okay, but that's money, and I'm a poor kid. <laughs> so <laughs> three ash is solid anyway. Three yeah. ash is good and secret, stops everything. Secrets because only the secret. He's a poor goes. kid. He'll spend. Yeah. yeah, he won't buy two ghost bell. He'll buy the best rarity of ash instead. Yeah. Or you, you you pull them. Like, like, like <laughs> or you pull them. Person. Oh yeah, yeah, that's the thing. Then we've got um, play it while you can. Yep. This card is ridiculous. Not shown and jump rarity, so... <laughs> no. This yeah. is the same guy who told me today, if you can't play max rarity, don't play your deck. Yeah. So we don't listen <laughs> to him. I mean, they're ultra, just ignore the little bit where it tells you it's not shown and jump. <laughs> so just ignore that bit. We're selling him out. You'll get secrets soon, don't worry. <laughs> um, three alert, again, this card's ridiculous. Not max rarity either. Yeah. I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll get there one day, boys. You're paying for your comments. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, if you open gold stock or alert, then you're, you're yeah. going to win. It's a good card. It's they're good very card. good. Uh, Foolish Burial. Yep. It's another copy of over, of Quietless, so it's really good. And it's yeah, it's broken. Two Fossil Dig and two Pill. Two Fossil Dig rather two than fossil three. Dig because it was either two Fossil Dig and three Armageddon Knight, or 
three Fossil Dig and two Armageddon Knight. Okay, fair and enough. And sometimes you don't open the dino stuff. So having three of the one that searches the not dino cards Makes is sense. better than having six copies of just the dinos. I'll let you do the maths on that one. Um, and two pill, you can run three, but I can't be asked to test it at three. It works at two. So, <laughs> I suppose you really, you've only got like four, target, uh, four targets, right? Um, two Quattlers, two... Because you can summon Pancratops. Oh yeah, that's true. Okay. Which I have done once. Wow. Um, Spicy. One fusion, you only need one. Only I one. Sometimes, I sometimes make the mistake of siding it out. Like, because I think, oh, I'm not going to need this, and then I do need it, and I lose, because I'm a scrub. Um, two Call by the Grave, because this deck's very normal summon reliant. Yeah. So, if you get Ash, then you're probably going to lose. Can't be dealing with those interrupts. Yeah, no, and then this card is so good. Like, it just does so much. And why can't he afford the third? Because he I spends sold, on Max I, I, everything else. Because I sold the third to buy Colossus. <laughs> that's why. Okay, all right. I'll let you off. <laughs> Getting roasted. Okay, right. Cool. Right, Let's extra see. Deck. Extra deck. This cool. is where all the money is. Yep. Three Colossus. Yep. Um, I never thought I would actually need the third, but I had to play against Chainburn twice mm -hmm. today, and I did actually end up summoning the third. Yep. So, yeah. Fuck maybe, Chainburn. Maybe drop it to two. Yep. Maybe keep it at three, because mm -hmm. I'm only playing one Titan, which again, I never thought I'd need more than one of this, mm -hmm. but I played Chainburn twice, and so I ended up needing a second and not having one. It's, to be fair, it's not every day you're going to play Chainburn. No, so that's probably left as it is. Um, Bottle Sword. Bottle Sword's Bottle Sword. Yeah, moving on. Um, Nightmares. These cards are amazing. Like The utility that they give you yeah. is just... It so goes good. in every deck. Yeah. Every good deck. We Witch, you just summon this on the main combo. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it's good. And you can add back Thunder Dragons or Overact with it when it dies. Sure. Some Summer Summoner. Some, 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 some. You sometimes summon it. No pun intended. Uh, <laughs> that was bad. Yeah, that was really bad. You should feel um, bad. It's, it's all right. Like, it's never that good. It's either you end on this, or you end on two Colossus, or you end on the We Witch and a Colossus. That's the only difference it gives you. So it's sometimes all right. Mm. This, you actually need this in case you omen Arbogeddon and... Or, sorry, if you op you have to link with Giant Rex and not with Overactor. Mm -hmm. So for, like, your really awkward hands, you need this because it means you still end on basically the same board. Mm -hmm. That's good. OTKs. Yep. Card's still good. And then the three rank fours, which they're all ridiculous. Do bits. This Abyss Dweller gave me so much trouble. This Abyss so. Dweller was um, Joe's best friend. No, like, it was not. His his farfers and his snows really enjoyed it. Let's say that. It's okay. After this, I'm gonna steal that card from him and throw it yeah. in the ocean. The called by the graves were good as well. Yeah. Dante likes being called. No, he doesn't. He likes being called Daddy. <laughs> um, Daddy Dante. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Um, side deck, we have God card. This is so good. It even looks like a god, doesn't it? Like it's, a dragon yeah. god. Thing. This. If I had a third, I would be playing three because Colossus is really vulnerable. To anything like Widow Anchor, Impermanence, mm -hmm. anything like that, Mind Control, this card is just so good. It's like, yeah, it, it's just a straight one for one trade, but and it can brick, but it's so, so good. Sometimes you have to put up with that. Yeah. Um, FTKs exist, and I don't want to be that 10 year old kid. Um, shout out to Jesse Cotton for. Also, not Max Rarity, guys, just. <laughs> Yeah, I'm working on it. <laughs> uh, this is Max Rarity. Um, Shout for a book of eclipses. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, this is just... I've never actually used these, resolved them, because I've only played against Thunder... In the like five weeks I've been playing this deck, I've only played against Thunder Dragons in one game. They're good in theory, though. They I are mean, really they good in sense. theory. So I'd keep them in, but I would not play three of it, because it's not worth it. Um, you have to play this. Mm -hmm. It's so good. Because you lose two... Sky Strikers, Altergeist. Well, I don't lose to Sky Strikers. <laughs> I beat Sky Strikers. I lose to Back Row. Um, and this rips through Back Row, and it's amazing. Mm -hmm. Too evenly. Yep. Um, again, I'm a poor child, so I had to sell one to get a Colossus. I was just about to ask you if two's <laughs> correct. <laughs> yeah, no, two's not correct. You should be playing three. Yeah, cool. Um, card shouldn't exist. It's broken. And then three Red Reboot, which is for like Paleo. Card's clutch. Is. Yeah, the number of times I can OTK with this is ridiculous. So, yeah. Cool. That's everything. That is everything. Okay, cool. Uh, any shout-outs you want to give? Um, shout-outs to Mark at Manascrew. 
He's an absolute legend. He is he indeed. He sorts out everything here in MK and um, Northampton. Gives um, us our space to play, right? He does indeed. And shout outs to all uh, the local band players for taking one for the team to keep the community alive. No comment. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, that's about it. Um, what about your Bedford boys? You can leave Bedford them out. Bedford boys. Oh my god, yeah, how could I forget them? Yeah, shout outs to the Bedford lot. So. It's all right, I'll do the shout out for him. Don't worry, guys. Yeah. All right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think that's more or less everything. Thank you very much for taking the time to go right. through that. I know you're uh, ready to head home. Uh, oh, so, yeah, thank you very much, guys. Don't forget to check out the links in the description. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to hit subscribe. Thank you. Lovely. I'm afraid that's all we have time for in this video. If by chance you haven't had enough of listening to me waffle at you through a video about a children's card game, you can follow me on Facebook and Twitter. The links are on the screen, or if you're feeling really lazy, you can click the links in the description. While you're at it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future content too. It'll make me smile, I promise. And who could ask for more than that? Thanks for watching, see you in the next one.